Peace, 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 love, oneness, divine vitality on all energy givers. So, <laughs> divine ancestors of the all, divine supreme healing lights coming through this divine message for divine clarity and what is on the energy grids for beautiful souls to be aware of. Mm, we ain't doing no cards today. Ain't no cards. Mm -mm, we ain't doing no cards today. We don't do this. And then pure authenticity being the word that we're going to stay on the topic at hand. When we're talking about pure authenticity, healing and ascending. Mm, mm, mm. And ones that would go to the depths to want to mess with that. And why us as chosen ones speak about these things as in Aquarian season we chose to go the divine route when we're talking about true chosen ones that truly are divine and activating their 144 DNA strand we are not doing the cults we are not doing these Masonic or occults or, or creating these groups and if we are we're not doing it at any low frequency and if we are doing it with manipulation it's with pure intentions so that would be us manipulating and reprogramming our subconscious mind so that we can heal and ascend with pure frequencies, not manipulating. So that's deep. Like I said, I go on here, we talk about the 13th Zodiac, baby. We talk about Aphiusius and how it manipulated with crystals. We use, see, we use these crystals to heal our body, to ascend, to elevate, to have a metamorphic flex in these ethers we don't do it to gain power over a masses a nikola tesla like we don't do all that so you got to understand that why us beautiful souls are speaking about these things in divine order and how some of our people got sucked back into that same timeline. Some a little more deeper when we're talking about Sodom and Gomorrah. Your, your kids dancing and twerking with you. This is much deeper. We talking about how they manipulated a culture and heritage. And then used it against them. It's much deeper than these cards. When you're talking about oracles, baby, it wasn't no cards. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Ain't no coincidence Queen Elizabeth just passed away. Ain't no coincidence when all of us is going within. It's a lot of stuff going on in the spirit realm. Y'all thinking this is going to continuously keep going on? And beautiful souls are standing in their power and seeing how manipulation has controlled the masses for too long. It's our birthright to flow in our pure authenticity, our natural birthright. So as we speak these things into existence, and are optimistic with the purity? Oh, baby. Hmm. Hmm.
though that's deep, yes, all of it's folding. And that's deep when we're talking about the Vatican. Make them bend, bow, and break at command. When you what where's the pure look at any of it? Where where in it do you see some purity? Because most of those crystals and gems, the, the original destination of them, when the crown was originally made. Let's talk about these frequencies. <laughs> so that's deep. When we're talking about this in Akasha and knowing our truths. So yes, they can keep it. We 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 here in the flesh, baby, to to remake it as we keep healing and ascending. And oh, baby, is it going to look more diviner? Is it going to look more better? So y'all already know, uh, incense holders, sage holders. I use this. I use this for uh my sage. Magnet, copper coiled antenna, point out crystals, Isis knot, genes of Isis. Well, tapping into your pure authenticity and flowing in that. And as you flow in that, and source protects you, it's the fact that once thought that they were going to. She don't know. She don't know. She don't know. She don't know. <laughs> but it's those depths of Olo Kun. Don't observe. Observe. And and would sit up and say that they love you. That you are, you know, you my twin flat. Like all of these things, we are to be aware. Just because somebody said that your twin flat. Baby, somebody say yeah, they your twin flame and can be one of your enemies from a past life. That is why we are to activate our discernment, especially during these times right now. Oh, baby, because as you heal and ascend, it's, it's a divine fact of new levels, new devils. Though, so, we're talking about crashing the Vatican and making it bend it break and bow at command devil in reverse is lived so we out here living healing and ascending we ain't out here manipulating the masses talking about removing demons when demon is demelanated one bending and making it bow at command go back to your natural habitat baby hmm so to understand these higher frequencies and the manipulation from the low frequencies, oh baby, it's dismantling. Dismantling. I told you, baby, we don't want no cards. Uh uh-uh. uh. Because I know you out here, everlasting lion. Want to sit up and do magic on a beautiful soul's channel to gain energy on theirs and still wondering why ain't, no, ain't nothing happening. Oh, oh, oh. And like I said, the deep depths of Olokun. How how is there still peace? How is there still pure love? When when somebody could project that much hate upon somebody, oh baby, because the purity reigns, the purity prevails. Where there's purity, there will always be an essence of peace. Mm-mm-mm. And as you are in those deep depths of it. You see them drowning. Because, baby, let me pull you down here since you want to put me in this water with you. Sit in it. And as I swim, drift off, and flow away, quantum leap, if you shall, (laughs) allow 
allowed that water to be a little clear so they can see something through it. Because the water that these beautiful souls, they just so, just like I said in my last content, just swamp water, just looking like gravy. They ain't filtering it out, taking no time to cleanse. Oh, somebody just so deep. I ain't got to cleanse. My magic is my cleansing. That's some straw. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. When the energy got you, that's, and that's deep. And we talk, deep. Well, and so like I said, demon, demelanated one. It's all still when we're talking about the, oh, come on, come on, the apostles. Ashe, when we're talking about vibrations, frequencies, energies, radiations, we're electromagnetic, we're multidimensional. At this frequency, and keeping it at this frequency, you see the matrix. Watch when somebody talks to you and you're still at this frequency. You see this freak? It's gentle. It's calm. It's at peace. Nothing and yet everything. Just be. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. It's in this space for a moment. So that, that right there. <laughs> How can you manipulate that? So, like I said, guys, you, you have to understand that when we're talking about vibrations, frequencies, and energies in the Vatican and manipulation. So, you see it. Control. The vibrations, frequencies, and energies of control. This is how you bend, bow, and break these energies. And speak it. I bind the vibrations, frequencies, and energies of control away from my vessel, away from my aura field. Go back to its natural habitat and to never return on this etheric plane ever again. Like as we speak these things and heal and really do this with optimism, it's divine. It's divine. It's your natural birthright to be at peace. So that's, that's deep too when we're talking about these things and about these Occults and groups, baby. Come on, chosen ones. We know we doing the work. The 144 DNA activation strands flowing within our vessels, baby. Doing this work. We now here manipulating the masses. Talking about it's only 144,000 people chosen. You could quit playing with me and those occult manipulated. You like, come on now. You know, at a higher frequency, you know the oneness in it. But to still keep telling people it's only 144,000 people that are chosen, you must be out your mind. And the truth is not in it. But the purity in it allows us to see it for what it is. <laughs> so many levels of consciousness. So when I understood that, yeah, but then it's these occults and these groups out here that want to control the masses and tell them that it's only 144,000 chosen ones. Quit playing. Cut it out. Mm, mm, mm. Now, Stephen, we're talking about the real chosen ones in this life. We did not choose a group, an occult. So we did not choose that. We chose the divine way. We chose to ascend and not minimize ourselves to any rules and regulations. These are cults and groups. It's still rules and regulations. There's still some binding being done. 
whether they want to admit it or not, you're still binded to this group. And I know you lying. Hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm feeling another child of Olo Kun come so I always wonder why like source put you in these type of situations and it's not the fact that you're playing dumb it's the fact that you're observing at a frequency that you're 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 still you're learning things too you're learning on this journey you're learning how things possess the vessel you're learning more of how things can be manipulated. This allows you to know, no, this ain't it. Ain't nothing divine in this. I don't feel love in this whatsoever. Manipulated love, if there's any. Mm-mm-mm. And cut it out. Just it's the if you're flowing in your authenticity and giving beautiful souls readings. Mm-mm-mm. To know that you're being attacked is still good. It's still divine. That is how. Beautiful souls are out here speaking about it. Because <laughs> a real priest and high priestess, we are out here uplifting the people with oneness. Yes, we do talk about the false prophets and how things are done. But we don't, we're not going to, it's, it's, It's the lower frequencies of exposure for me that I've seen. And it's still some binding in it. Because I had to understand that too when we're talking about a return to sender frequency. Your authenticity and knowing where it's coming from. Oh, baby. Ancestors be like, "Mm mm-mm. I got this. And you chose not to do a return to send? Oh, yes. I got this. Mm, mm, mm. And do they step in and show out? Would that be another thing when you do a return to send? If you do, if you decide to do a return to send, it's like they think they know. Oh, well, she did a return to send. They know, know the magic. They know this. They know that. No. Purity, baby. That's the purity in it. Hmm? Mm, mm, mm. They don't get that with Afiusha's 13th. The purity in it. Mm, mm, mm. I stay in my pure, authentic frequencies. Pure beliefs. Pure faith. Pure understanding, pure, sweet, unconditional love, baby. Hmm? Mm, mm, mm. Mm. So with that being said, what mm, the audacity of it. But it's divine honor in it. I am grateful for every lesson. It taught me to stand in my power. And in standing in my power, what natural abilities, gifts, talents that I have, that I amplify, that activates more within that I activate. This is why we are to know thyself. And as you know thyself, that self 
is what the low vibrational energies want to mess with. So I got to consistently put that on my content. Million, billion, trillion year old earthly plane, just this earthly plane we reside on right now. All these thought patterns. And with that being said, who said that they're yours? So if you're you you have some jealousy or envy or overthinking or lust, you have some type of thought pattern or energy that may be latched on to the 14-year-old little boy or girl from your past life. If it's something that the energy can latch on to and give you another thought pattern to intensify it because you choose not to heal it. Mm, mm, mm. Showing now more than ever. You ain't got to be around a beautiful soul to know, especially ones that's out here doing magic. On they last little limbs. Mm. So, ooh, baby, come, come through. I'll show you. I said, some nut fingers is, your fingers is getting numb. You would think you would just stop. How do you keep wanting to do black magic? Your fingers is numb. Somebody's think about, to, about to go get operations and get fingers cut off because source and ancestors is coming through your fingers to make you stop they going numb that's a sign (laughs) y'all it's not funny but it is because some some will really go through the depths to do magic on beautiful so especially us chosen ones doing the work in our pure frequencies like, yo, y'all beautiful. Mm, mm, mm. Rainbow colors. Pure rainbow colors. Ashe to Archangel to Harriel. Ashe to all divine Archangels out here assisting us through any circumstance. As long as we stay focused in our truest and purest authentic frequencies staying like y'all y'all gonna hear me say it a lot now because it's like of course they're gonna get triggered of course they're gonna get triggered by these high frequency words y'all ain't going within to heal it yeah of course you can get your pure you can get some pure authenticity you gotta go within and do some work to get it though it ain't no talking about, oh, well, we got to destroy this person. We got to destruct this person. Or this is this is witchcraft or this is dark magic. We got to destroy it. Like, be aware. Now, more than ever, being aware. Because I know you lying. <laughs> that go back to the pitch force. Here he, here he, kill the witches. Like, this, this, that's all I'm getting out of that. Mm, mm, mm. And especially when we're talking about the Christianity frequencies and the cross and the ankh. Like I said, mm, mm, mm. when it comes to that, I don't discriminate at all. But when it comes to that, I I don't recommend it. Not for our people. As we heal and ascend, and keep elevating the 144 DNA activation strands is with nature outside. It has nothing to do with a building. Why you think they wanted it to be out of nature to build something and put you in it? Took you out of nature, made you build something and put you in it to reprogram your mind. That's what church is. Let's let's just get brief and simple. But then when you go to the aunt that represents the womb, man and woman, and temples, that's at another frequency. So 
So I understood that when I kept healing and ascending and they were saying deity, deity, instead of God or goddess, oracle, divine teacher, you know, it hit different. It was getting more understandings and knowledge and listening to the sound waves and the frequencies that come off of them. The words in general and then the sound waves that come off when other beautiful souls are speaking about it. It gives you their perspective of it. it. It lets you know if they've healed certain things or if they're just saying it to force it on you to believe what they believe. Like, all of that plays grave importance in how optimistic a beautiful soul is or how confident they are in what they're speaking on. And are they really living that life? Are they out here faking it? And I just put the sculptures on here. Though, y'all know my rings charms it's pretty much you can email me ancient universal profits with a z at gmail.com email me for any ordering and that'd be another thing these is this is the real deal right here you'll get you can I'm not on any other pages talking about readings or any of that if I do I'm sharing my content on there I'm not going to come in your inbox soliciting you so if you get any posts with my name or anything that is not me I've peeped game about that too we we'll talk about that when we're talking about occults and groups a lot of ones that are in a cult, certain ephas and babalawus that are in these low vibrational cults, them be the ones that's going to come in your inbox, baby. The false prophets. Mm-hmm. Well, shit, code nothing around here. And so be so upset when you expose them. How you going to be upset when somebody exposed you, but you wanted to come and Expose me. (laughs) And then you want to come and expose a chosen one to your illusions. (laughs) And it doesn't sound psychotic. So yeah, something's possessing the vessel. We 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 gotta talk about these things, guys. It's time. We are to be talking about these things. It's the fact that they this Florida water. Let me hit it. It's the fact that's in a Florida water. And then, like I said, I pick crystal. So put some of the crystal quartz in there. Get some herbs. Put some in there too. It's the fact that some would go to the depths of this stuff. Somebody be aware when when beautiful souls are coming in your dreams and want to have sex with you in your dreams. They want to attach to you. On their last limbs. Oh, let's see, I can see if I can project and make love to her in her dream. See if that'll you know, let her know that I love her. It's still, it's manipulation. Ain't no love in that. And it's disgusting. How dare you? How dare men and women? Women and women, and it's still an incubus, succubus type of energy. How dare you? Going to somebody's dream state or just dreaming about them and having sex with them. And you're not even with them. Now don't get me wrong. Hey, when I didn't, when I wasn't healing and doing the work, I didn't understand that part. So this is for somebody else too. It's it's okay. Just change your thought patterns. Let them go. Especially if they're not there in the now. They're not there in the now for a reason, for you to heal from it so that you can let it go. 
beautiful souls got to understand that that's still some type of sex magic involved. And these other energies that's in the unseen that will play with your thought patterns in your mind, know this. That's why they play with sexual energy. So they can play with your sexual energy. Some of you, that's how these energies can get in. That's why we have to discipline ourselves with our sacral energy. Sacral, sacred. Hmm? A shade of that. And let me tell oh, Shay, come through us. How you alchemize your sacral. When when those vibrations come about, think about what you want to manifest. Think about sitting in that cock and, and going to do some laundry or going to pick up you some groceries from the vegetable market. Or some like realm with me, if you shall, when we're talking about alchemizing so that you can heal this. And it'll activate your celibacy frequencies to be celibate so that you can go within. Because I know they lying. I know they lying. Like the ancestors said, they can keep it in the Vatican. We're here to remake it and to make it divine. Divine. Mm, mm, mm. Out here playing with these energies. Controlling the masses. Playing with these energies. Got people in fear about demon when you can make it bend and bow at command with the melanated one. That's at a higher frequency. I put that on my content several times. To understand that high frequency. Get some water. Understanding that high frequency, you activate more. We are to. Bend and bow, make these words bow at command. So no, we ain't put, uh-uh, uh-uh. There's a lot of things that are no longer accepted. As we stand in our truths and speak our truths, these occults is bending, dismantling. Cause you ain't finna sit, you ain't finna sit up and tell a whole masses is only a hundred and forty-four thousand chosen ones. I know you everlasting lying. When one hundred and forty-four DNA activation strand is something that anyone with a soul can tap into. Mm, it's not given. It's not. These occults and groups just, just cut it out. Just cut it out. And it's dismantling them. And they and that's deep too. They're choosing who to let in the group. Yeah. You got to have a certain level of consciousness for you to even get in this group. Because you still got to be manipulated some type of way. So I know you lying. Ain't that much playing dumb in the world. It's the puppets for me. They got to understand that you're, you're still puppets when we're talking about the 1% and Rockefeller and the manipulation of the crystals. When we're talking about that, they're still the puppets. So for our people to be doing it on our people and, and these certain other Masonic groups to still be doing this, you're still doing it in their name. You're still doing it and the manipulation that distorted the culture and heritage from John. So you're still falling under that spell. 
to want to control and manipulate a mass masses. This deep, and we're talking about Nikola Tesla, and the where, where, where you think he got that from? <laughs> Source didn't give him that. That was given to somebody else before it was given to him. He was just one that decided to speak about the sacred knowledge of it. And show you the work his way. Mm -mm -mm. His way. So I ain't going to talk about it when you're talking about the scrolls. And how the Pharaoh and Kemet Akunaten is Moses from the Bible. They ain't going to tell you these things. They want you to stay away from who you truly are. Come on now. So I know you everlasting lying when we talking about matrix breaking. Bend and bow at command. I have my own universe. And it's going to stay pure. And it's going to bear fruit and be plentiful for nations and nations to come. That's the vibrations of a priest, a priestess, pharaohs, chosen ones that understand their soul missions and soul purposes. So you out your, I know you out your everlasting mind. Yes, y'all did. We got to put that in there too. They're dismantling. We don't need no cause to tell nobody's story. It's the one that's in it. The divine oneness in it. Cars running by, accelerator going, and <laughs> yeah, boy, wait, wait, where you, where you, where you run to? Ain't that much running in the world. You wasn't running when you was doing all that work. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. But it's it's done. You've quantum leaped and jumped out of that portal. Ain't nobody, uh-uh. Nobody go back. Won't do them type of sankofas. Them type of sankofas, uh-uh. I don't want to feel none of your karma. That's what you, uh-uh. You going to get that. Catch that. Live in it. Be in it. Heal it. And ascend from it. Hey, but the law of not caring, because you did not care when you was doing what you were doing. And the depths of destruction that you thought you was going to be doing. Mm. Mm -mm. So, yeah, that's that's deep when we're talking about what's going on in this life. The manipulation. The manipulation tactics and experiments and instruments. The manipulative instruments that they've used. It, it went beyond the crystals. Now they got instruments. It's much deeper than our phones. You know, we know our phones carry radioactive frequencies. We know microwaves. When you warm your food up in a microwave, it takes all the nutrients out of it. it puts radioactive frequencies on it. Have you understood that? Why you warm your food up? You warm it up in the oven or on the stove. You, your energy still have some replenishing energy, especially if it's high frequency food. Though, so if you have high frequency food and you're putting it in the microwave and you're wondering why you're still getting a little sleepy or a little tired or your energy is off, it's from the radioactive frequencies from the microwave. So shift that. Put it in the air fryer or toaster oven. So that's deep. I, I recommend anybody to... 
No longer use a microwave, especially if you're on your spiritual healing journey. Us beautiful souls, chosen ones, uh-uh. We don't use microwaves. That's, mm-mm. Got me, uh mm It had you itching. It got me scratching. Mm-mm. <laughs> had you scratching and itching. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. It ain't, it ain't for us. No, I love saying I like home, nature. Or what do you say? Say phone, home, the stars. Almost like, and you got to understand that too, like you, when you understand a higher power or higher frequencies, like the stars and, and the constellation, like that's a curtain. It's just a curtain. Pull that curtain back and see that there's other worlds beyond that curtain. <laughs> it takes levels of purity to understand just that one frequency alone. Mm-hmm. And the purity. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The purity in it. Purity in it. And how it keeps prevailing in our vessels. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, y'all already know. Divine, divine, divine honors. As we keep healing and ascending, it allows us to see it for what it is, y'all. Like, <laughs> like I said, ain't no secrets. Just unhealed situations. No matter what age it is, like you gotta grab them and hug them and love them and let it go. With that being said, peace, love, oneness, divine vitality on all energy grids. Ashe Soul Tribe.